where the wall ends near Yuma, Arizona. So the wall goes on for miles right here, comes down. The Colorado River is right on the other side. The U.S. territory extends out so many feet and it stops right here because there's an Indian reservation right here. And uh, the border is not technically open, but it is at the same time technically open. Um, and that is because the Indian, the Indian tribe right here, um, it's their sacred land. Anyway, so what's going on with Eagle Pass, Texas? Um, I'll, the border is a lot more secure in Eagle Pass right now. It's a lot harder for them to move the migrants across the border. So a lot of them are being sent up to Arizona and California. And they are just starting to, from what I understand, starting to possibly see an influx of crossings in this area due to the Eagle Pass area being a lot of so many crossings that's been going on in Eagle Pass. Dang it, service is horrible right here, man. Let's see. Connected. Okay. Let's see if we're back. I don't know if we're back or not, guys. For those of you on YouTube, I'm trying to do a, uh, I'm doing this. Border Patrol currently searching for migrants right now. We do have permission from Border Patrol to be here. Oh, he's also dragging out the road. Interesting. So. Yes. We are near the Indian Reservation. This is where the Indian Reservation starts right here. So let me show you guys something real quick. Zoom out. Oh, we are zoomed out. Okay. So this is where the wall, the border wall is at. Um, the border wall right here, it comes south along the uh, Colorado River. The river is probably like 50 feet away from the wall right here. And then right here, it just stops. And the reason why it stops is because there is an Indian reservation right here. And uh, it is sacred, la sacred land. So they are unable to um, extend the wall through the land right now. And we are out here staging. Waiting for migrants to cross. Um, just earlier, just earlier there was some lights over here right on the other side of the border wall 